All right, wait. I got it. All right. Who am I? All right, hey guys. My name is Jack. I'm a exercise science major, senior, pre-professional concentration. Um, my favorite thing to do is lift weights, study, exercise, play basketball, and thank you for tuning in. Hi, I'm Yuri. I'm business management major. I'm junior. Um, I like to go skiing, hiking, outdoor stuff, and um, do calling pics. Hi guys, I'm Hayato, sustainable development major, junior from Japan, exchange student, and I like taking picture and skiing. Hey, I'm Elena. I'm a senior management major and Spanish minor. And my favorite thing to do is go hiking and sleeping yes. and eating. <laughs> my name is Richard Moore. Uh, my major, I'm a double major in international business and business management, minored in Japanese. And my hobbies are soccer and basically just playing FIFA when I'm not playing soccer. <laughs> I'm a senior. <laughs> Um, I'm a little indifferent about it. I'm glad to, I guess, get my undergraduate over with, but at the same time, I have another four years ahead of me in pharmacy school, so it doesn't really feel like I'm truly graduating from school. I, uh, I don't want to leave upstate, so bad. Um, I want to stay here forever, not forever, but <laughs> at least for college years. Um, yeah, I enjoy upstate so much. Oh, I'm not ready. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> I'm not ready. Uh, I'm kind of ready to leave. It's been eight years. I should graduate school <laughs> by now. Um, for like the third, fourth, and fifth time graduating. Yeah, I graduated once. Um, I probably chose to come to this school because of the surrounding area. I really love to hike. And Boone is really great for that. So in Boone, one of my favorite things to do has been just exploring nature and hiking. Uh, since I'm from Tokyo, a big city, I love to go to go hiking and kayaking. Mm, sitting, just sitting outside and studying. I love those kind of moments. Just hanging out with a friend. Uh, and nature? Um, my favorite thing in Boone is going out on the parkway and how there's no mosquitoes over the summer. My favorite thing in Boone would probably be the summers with no humidity compared to growing up on the beach where everything is just humid. It's like you're swimming in air. If I had to describe ASA in one word, I would say friends. Family. Fam. Love. <laughs> A family. Um, after leaving App State for the summer, I'm planning on relaxing a little bit, then going to California, exploring California a little bit, and then just getting ready for pharmacy school and the next uh, four years. Um, I'm just going back to Japan. I'm going back to my own college, graduate in one and a half years, um, and start working, hopefully. Well, I'm just gonna be lame student again in Japan. No, I'm joking. I'm, I'm just. I don't know, I'm just going back and then being steady. Uh, hopefully get a big girl job. I have an interview on Friday. Um, but if that doesn't work out, then I guess I'm just going to go home and keep job hunting. What are your plans after leaving App State? Well, first I'm going to France for four months to finish my management degree and then get a job, right? Right, that's what I should do. Um, one easy regret of mine is probably not doing as well my 
academic wise my first couple years and really having to make up for it in the later years? Um, I don't know. I could, well, I just want it. I wish I could stay at Upstate for longer, more, longer. <laughs> um, or um, I have many restaurants that I've never been to in Boone, so I want to go. I don't regret anything. Slacking off freshman year, grades wise, and not being more involved. Uh, being far away from my family, I guess, and not always being able to go home. My most cherished moment of ASA, one of my most favorites was going to New York. I thought that was really cool. Um, I really love New York, so, you know, it was a plus to go to New York. And I mean, it was just, it was better just to be able to go with ASA and my friends. I don't have like the best moments, but I like, I like to study with everybody in the library until two or three in the morning because it was just fun and every single meeting because we can like feel closer and closer. Well, the ASA retreat from last semester was definitely that was a really good moment for me. And also, oh, Lion Dance last semester, the, I did it with Sachin, Martin, Kevin, that was really good. New York and Washington last year and getting first place in prelims in lip sync freshman year. It would probably just be like the meetings and hanging out with everybody. Like it gives you kind of like a break at the end of the day on Wednesdays. Anyways. Um, I would say, you know, definitely don't just come to one meeting and then, you know, have an impression from there. You know, attend multiple meetings, definitely stay connected, um, join in, you know, meeting uh, activities outside of meetings because, you know, you, I guarantee you, you will make some great friends in ASA. Be ready for the craziness of ASA. Oh, can you go back to Japan instead of me? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. I just don't want to leave. Um... Just go to every meeting, uh, regardless of topic that they're gonna do in that day. Just just enjoy like an hour every week with really cool people. Um, get involved, hang out with people outside of club meetings, and really get to know them and join exec or run for it be able to make friends and talk to people like not don't sit alone yeah like talk to everybody talk to people that's how you make friends right come on out um uh there'd be there'd be a lot of a lot of hard tasks if i lost my fingers i wouldn't be able to point wouldn't be able to get the thumbs up um It'd be hard to eat french fries. I'd probably, it'd be hard to wipe my butt. You know, I'd probably imagine it'd be like, you know, something. <laughs> I don't know. Playing the piano, even though I don't play piano. <laughs> oh, I was never able to use chopstick. Typing and washing my hair. Everything? I, writing? Doing anything really? I mean, I'm losing my fingers. <laughs> Everything would be hard. I just have nubs. <laughs> I would rather have no water to bathe in in my house or like a facility because I could just jump into a, a pond or a lake or something. Just take my uh, shampoo with me. You know? I would like to have water because since I'm in the US, I don't have um, like signal outside of campus and I don't need it. I don't need internet. So yeah, I choose water. 
No, no internet, of course no internet. Oh my gosh, I miss bathtub a lot. No internet. <laughs> I, could, I could actually deal without the internet, so I mean, I like to be clean, so water all day. Give me water, no internet. I would, um, that's a tough one, that's a tough one. I would say, I'd probably say, wear it on my head. Because if it rains, then I'm good. I would say over my head because it's it might be fashionable in future. <laughs> I can do both. It's over your head. It's like kind of basic because everyone does that. I mean, every like a, you know funny person. Well, like over your pants, it will be fashionable. Over my pants, because that's what the superheroes do. Over my pants, yo. Don't y'all remember, like, no, that's the 90s cartoon. Never mind. Captain Underpants. Definitely wear underpants. Over my pants. <laughs> okay, so my dad answers the phone first. And I'm like, all right, hey, dad. So, uh, yeah, so you know how I went to uh, the game last night? Well... I decided to go to the library instead and study. So now I'm gonna be here studying for a while. I probably will be studying for the next week, so you probably won't see me back in a little bit. <laughs> I'm just arrested. <laughs> I didn't do anything bad. Um, I'm a good girl. Um, <laughs> maybe. Um, please convince somebody to let me out. That's it. Hello, mom. I just wanted to be free as this shit annoys me a lot. Um, I was just, I just wanted to feel nature with my naked body. <laughs> I like that <laughs> <laughs> you are done. Okay, thanks. Ring ring. Hey mom. Um, I am in jail. But don't worry, I didn't kill anyone. Did y'all catch the game? See the naked dude running? That was me.